hey guys what's up welcome to the help videos created by the tradermate.in for the real-time feeder that is the rtf software in this video we're gonna show you what are the settings you guys need to do in the ami broker database so here first i'm gonna show you how you can create a new database and perform the settings so first you guys need to click on this file and then go to new and then database and then uh, here just give a new name for your database i'm gonna give the name rtf for my database and uh, you guys can give any name and then after that just click on this create and it will create the database with the name you have specified here and then select the checkbox which says load this database at startup if you select this option then what happens is whenever you're going to open up the ami broker you know this database will be opened so we're going to select that one and then in this data source panel you need to make sure that you got this local database selected for this data source and then in this base time interval make sure that tick is selected and here you guys can see several options are available but you need to make sure that tick is selected and then we need to click on this intraday settings and here it will open up intraday settings window and here you guys need to select show day session only and then you guys need to check on this filter weekends checkbox and then in this trading hours panel you guys need to specify the starting and end time for your market since we are providing the nsc data we're gonna specify the market time for the nsc so it's gonna be 9 15 to 3 30 so it's gonna be 15 30 if, if the time is 3 30 pm then you guys need to specify 15 30 you know you guys need to specify the time in 24 hour format and then in the daily time compression uses select the local time not the exchange time select the local time and then in the per database settings panel select allow mixed evod intraday data and once you do that click on ok and then again click on ok and this will create a new database in your ami broker and it can properly get the data from the real-time feeder now whatever the steps that i have explained is for creating a new database and if you guys want to use our rtf software with an existing ami broker database then you guys need to open that database and then you need to click on file and uh, database settings and here in this database settings window you know it will not allow you guys to create the database but you guys can change the settings and in the uh, data source panel select local database for the data source and then uh, you need to make sure that base time interval is tick selected you know as i have explained before and also you guys need to click on the intraday settings and here also you guys need to do the same step so you guys need to select the uh, show day session only and then you guys need to check on this filter weekends checkbox and also you guys need to specify the uh, trading hours as uh, 9 15 and 15 30 that is the market time for nsc and also in the uh, daytime compression uses you need to select local time and in this per database settings you need to select the allow mixed eod intraday data once you guys do that just click on ok and ok again you know that changes will be applied to the existing database and you guys will be able to properly use the real-time feeder that is the rtf software to get the data so this is it guys this is about the database settings that you guys need to do to get data from the real-time feeder and in the other tutorials you guys can learn how to get the real-time iod and eod data from rtf to the ami broker so thank you for watching guys and i'll see you in the next tutorial